Vegas. Uh, so great to be with you tonight here in Glendale, Arizona. Um, obviously some great fights going on here, but there's so much excitement about your own career. A two division champion already at age 22. Um, you're going to be returning the flyway early next year. What can you tell us about that next fight right now? Yeah, my next fight's already for the WBO world title against Christian Gonzalez at 112. Uh, sometime in March, if not early next year. So I'm getting, I'm going to get ready for that soon. What is it? What was it about? I mean, look. I mean, honestly, I think as a member of the boxing writers, we're going to vote soon on Fighter of the Year. You're going to be in that conversation. Dimitri Bivol may win it, but you're going to be right there. Um, you had a sensational year with victories over Sarangvasai and Quadras. Very impressive. What made you decide that you didn't want to stay at Super Flyweight right now? You want to go back to Flyweight and for your champion? It was always a plan to win a world title from 108 up, but I outgrew 108, so um, I plan on going back down to 112. I, I was making 115 pretty easy, but I do want that second world title in my second division, so that's why we decided to move back down. Is it, so you you definitely will fight at 115 again. It's just a matter of making sure that you remain champion. At, yeah, I'm definitely moving back up, um, you know, after a title or two at 112 and 150, I'm going to do the same up there. How happy are you with, with the way 2022 played out? Man, I'm happy with 2022. It's a year that changed my life completely. Um, everything changed for the better, and I, I couldn't be more happy with, with, uh, with the way my life's been playing out this year. It's an incredible story. I mean, we don't see it every day. We're two brothers. I guess we could go back to Juan Manuel Marquez and Rafael Marquez, but it's been a long time since two brothers have succeeded the way you and your brother Josh Franco have. I know that you know having brothers. I think you can be as honest as you can possibly be with your brother, yeah. and they can uplift you, and they can tear you down, and they can make you better. What is it about your relationship with Josh that makes you guys succeed so much? Uh, me and my brother, we we've been to the worst together. Uh, we've been to the highest together. And that, I, I think stuff like that makes what make, what makes the relationship that much stronger. My brother, he's, he's uh, my bestest friend ever, I, and I look up to him more than anybody. And just to have him training with me in Riverside or back home, it, just, it means everything to me. So as far as I understand it, the, the opponent will be Christian Gonzalez for you next. Yes. And uh, what with the contract and everything like that, where's that stand? And do you have any idea of a date and a location? Uh, sometime in March, I believe, maybe in Texas, but I haven't heard anything official, so I can't really say it on that right now. No problem. It'll uh, certainly be on the zone, I would yes. imagine, though. All right, great, Bam. We can't wait to see you. Thank you so much for the 2022 you provided.